Here we go. The Sony VPL X5. Now this one's had, as I said, as I showed you earlier, the replacement lamp ballast. So I stripped it, I replaced all the lamp ballast, and here we go. Just gonna fire it up. Here we go. Here we go. Here the fans running, and we're off. Green flashing LED for power up. Lamp. Nice and merrily. Okay. And the Sony image on the screen. You see that? And coming up nicely. And staying on the screen. Yeah, there we go. And there's the icon, it's gone off and it's searching for the inputs. Now, I don't know whether you can see that logo, right? But look how white balanced that is. Look how white balanced that is. These are one of the very early projectors. And as you can see, that image, although it's a blue background, it's still absolutely perfect absolutely perfect the convergence on the panels is still absolutely perfect look how crisp that is look how crisp it is let's focus it up look at that no no convergence edging by the red green and blue offset or anything absolutely perfect on that icon and these are like you know m mega years old they still do 1024, 768, they still do 800 by 600 res, and they are perfect. And uh, so yeah, so the other one needs a replacement ballast, this one's out of ballast since uh, I showed you earlier, and it's uh, absolutely perfect. Alright, so there we go, Anki Dore. All on Kidori. Thank you very much for watching. My name is John. The company is JVS Visual in Birmingham. Uh, we do a flat rate repair on projectors. It's a hundred pounds uh, at the moment, and all you pay is for your parts. All right. So if it takes me four or five hours to drip down, it takes me four or five hours to drip down, and uh, do all the projectors, the Optimus, the Sony's. Panasonic's, the Sharps, the Sanyo's, the whole ranges. Alright, thanks for watching.